Hello, my name is Emma Shaughnessy, and today I will be teaching you how to use Quizlet. Quizlet is a free website for students and teachers to use to create study guides and develop healthy study habits. So here is what signing up looks like. You'll just input your information into here. However, I am already signed up, so I'm just going to log in with Google through my Western account. So, in Quizlet you can create study guides and organize them by class and title them differently. If I go to my classes over here, you can see I have a math skills class that I created. And here is one of my study guides called Math Skills Number 1. You can click on the study guide and you can see all of the terms in the set. Quizlet sets it up as if they're flashcards. That's kind of the format that it is created in. So you, sometimes you have to get a little creative. But what's cool about it is you have all these different options for studying. So I can click learn and we'll start. And then I choose, okay, 19 and I have to choose which one of these it is. Do this one and you just continue. You can go back. You can do a uh, write-in. So unfortunately with some of these you have to be creative and try to remember what you typed. See for this one I actually I did 4 plus 6 but I didn't remember. So that's the only part is that it is kind of based around memorization. Um, but there's a lot of different options. You have tests over here, you have matching, you have games, you have learning. You can also keep your study guides private or public. So if I go to edit, I can change the visibility. I can say just myself. However, I do want to keep this open to everybody, just in case. So, Quizlet is a great tool for students starting roughly at 5th or 6th grade. It's usually better for older students. Um, the game option makes it a little more engaging and a little more fun. And then the test option is great if you want to practice quizzing yourself without the stress of having to take an actual test. You can also search for other creators' study sets. So I want more math skills, let's say, and I'll just type in math skills and you can see there are a ton of different creators that you can look at these different study sets for. Just make sure that the information is correct. Teachers can create study guides and organize them by class and then make them visible for students when they're ready, like for releasing a study guide. Um, you can also record your voice for each study set. So if you go to edit, you can see over here there is an option to add a voice recording for each term and definition. And this kind of adds an auditory component to it which can help students absorb information quicker. And then the last thing that I want to show you is you go to, let's find it, I might have to sign out, oh, right here. You can upgrade and have a little more options. So it's only $20 for a one-year subscription. You can also do $12 one. And you have all these extra benefits that you can get. And you do have a free trial with it, but I was thinking if teachers wanted to use it to add a little extra options for their students, this would be a really good opportunity. So I highly recommend Quizlet. It's a great way to study. It's a great way to show and teach students how to study. Um, I honestly had poor study skills until I found Quizlet and I feel like I've learned a lot. So yeah, enjoy. Thank you very much.